journey of life, there are milestones. And if you look at your journey holistically, there are successes, there are failures. As individuals, we are never a success or a failure. So we set a goal for ourselves. We some, sometimes succeed in achieving that. And sometimes we fail to achieve that. Right? That doesn't make us a success or a failure. But that larger goal that we all push, the purpose of my life. What is my value proposition? What have I come to this earth for? To this planet for? What is my larger purpose? What is that uniqueness that I have that I have with me? And how far I have been able to give back to the planet with my value proposition? You know, that makes me successful. That make that gives me on my mission towards that, that goal. So that's in, in a long journey if you're traveling to Delhi then there are multiple stations. You know. Sometimes you uh, sometimes we get down at a station and then we change our course. And then we take another path. Right? But we always keep chasing a destination. And many of you may not know that uh, he is also a farmer. Mm -hmm. He's a technocrat but he's also a farmer. Right? So there are many courses that we can take in our life. There are many paths that we can like, take, take in our life. So, you know, in a larger scheme of things, there is no success and failure. There is success, there are milestones, there is no failure, there are learnings. Right? Sometimes we don't achieve the milestone, don't achieve the mission, but we learn a lot. And then we decide to change course, we decide to change our path, we decide to change our actions, we decide to change our strategy, we keep moving. That's how we keep moving. So that's how I look at a success. I will pause here and, and I think there are a lot of questions which are already been framed which will come our way and then we will try to deliver it on those questions rather than making it a monologue. So I agree everything with him. I think you are all gone through appraisal, right? So we want promotions, we want to build buy a house, we want to you know, car, etc. Or we want, uh, you know, we are not telling you the other thing properly, you know, that's, I'm not able to stand my foot yet. So, uh, there is so much, uh, you know, variations and ups and downs, okay. What I learned, I'm going to tell you. So when I keep looking at it, first I thought, okay, I was just a developer in the US, I want to be an architect. So I become an architect. Then I said, okay, I'm an architect, but I want a distinguished engineer, you know. There are MDS1, MDS2, what you have, some we have different positions, right? You keep chasing things. And sometimes you don't get, sometimes you get, right? When you don't get, you, you are in misery. You think, oh, my life is gone, I'm dead, what to do, family cries, your mother-in-law, your mother, everybody knows. Then again you pick up yourself, come again and you are in a full of race, you know. So this is what typically happens, right? Um, then later I realized, then you know we bought a house, car, everything has come, but what is that success that means? What I understood is, um, in some people, you can have goals, set your goals, okay, so I want to be here for this time. But you need to enjoy the journey. This is you. This also you heard long time. Right? Enjoy the journey. And then what the hell it means? What it means? Just you take a very micro thing, okay? Because when you put that, okay, I want to be the CEO. Somebody told, I think the party, right? I will replace Ali in four things. <laughs> I like that guy. <laughs> okay? You can replace. No problem. Keep dreaming. Okay? I don't know, somebody said, okay, you can drink the yeah, guy. Definitely I like to see you here. But I think you should you should definitely know that you know don't put yourself uh, expectation or very far. Okay, then you will be always living in the chasing game. Okay, very far. Okay, I wanted to make let's say salary of fifty lakhs per year or one per year. You know, always too far. So how do we define success? As long as you work with your full potential, you give your best to whatever given situation, okay? And you work your intelligence and hard working and go out of the way, you are successful. That's it, okay? Because you have to take life like that. Otherwise, you are going to chase like crazy, okay? So you have to just, am I, with my full potential I have given, 
and you should have a right perception. Perception is very important. Perception means seeing thing as it is. Okay, you don't bloat it more. Okay, somebody says, oh, rumors are all about what, hey, you know what, that guy is going to ruin my life or he's talking about me or whatever it might be. You have to take the situation as it is and then put your intelligence, put your potential, close your laptop, go back home, you are happy, you are successful. If you go, see, what happens is your path is keep opening up. Okay, you will be keep opening up the path and then you will reach your destination. But if you are in that constant chase of things, I don't think so your potential is out. That's why you may never achieve things. Okay, so for me success is that taking that one step. I have a large goal, but I want to see that one step at a time and see I am putting the full potential and I am going to, uh, you know, have my intelligence put, hard work in done and I am happy, I am successful. Let me look for the next opportunity. That's how you want to move in life.